Carl, we were previously talking about the $4 trillion club, and now NVIDIA is the sole member of the $5 trillion club. President Trump telling reporters just uh, overnight that he would bring up, quote, super-duper Blackwell chips with President Xi in trade talks, and that definitely helped the stock momentum today, but the stock really moved on revenue visibility. Yesterday, NVIDIA's CEO pointed to $500 billion in cumulative data center revenue for 2025 and 2026. That number really surprised a lot of the street because it runs at least about 10%. I've seen even some estimates 20% higher than their current estimates. That's significant upside and why you're seeing so many upgrades this morning. For example, Melia is bumping their price target to $300 from $275. Goldman sees further upside from OpenAI deployments, sovereign government deals, and, of course, the timing of the Rubid chip launch, which is the next architecture for their GPUs. Now on that China angle, CEO Jensen Wong told me on CNBC yesterday that only Trump can solve the trade impasse. He even ended his speech yesterday with make America great again. Wall Street currently models zero, zero China revenue following export bans. So any deal would represent upside, not priced in. NVIDIA is now worth more than all of the S&P 500 energy, real estate, and material stocks combined. This according to uh, just our data desk here. The stock is up roughly 56% year to date, but has lagged other AI names like Broadcom and Oracle as investors do worry about bubble talk. But Hyperscalers report over the next 48 hours, or I should say some of them even tonight, which could provide further catalysts if AI spending commentary stays strong.